Thank you, Ted. We're trying to debate to wait. Is it better to be on the, the, how we do it now between March and November or permanently how it is the November time we are to now March? Is, is, I think what they're proposing that we keep it. We keep right. the March to November time. Right. The yeah. sunset will not happen at 4 o'clock. It would happen at 5. We're going to fall back and make it happen at 4 o'clock sort of artificially. Correct. That yeah. was very confusing what you just said. Yes. But, but I worry if we do this, what, what would we argue about in this country now? <laughs> yeah. Be, what could we possibly left? argue about as Americans this, anymore? This will bring us together, I think. It this is pretty is, interesting. Is I think equalizer. that a Republican senator with Marco Rubio and, and our right. party, Maria Democrat, yeah. have come together on this because you often see them on opposite sides of discussions. So that's interesting, if nothing else. Right. But yeah, for those of you who, uh, I mean, most, most of it changes on your phone, right? So there's not, and, and a lot of your uh, Amazon it. devices, it changes, and your Alexas and all of those kind of things. But uh, if, you, if you still have the VCR blinking in your house right now at uh, <laughs> yeah. 12 o'clock, then that, you know, that's another issue. <laughs> yeah, altogether. I guess that's true. <laughs> but either way, the, the weather, we were expecting this big storm, yeah. and, and it's coming, or it's. Yeah, I mean, right now you look outside, I mean, take so a look bad. at this uh, picture we have at, uh, of Seattle. Mm -hmm. Sunny, right? But we told you yesterday the middle of the day Friday was going to be nice, and that's what we're seeing right now. Here are sunny skies in Seattle, and uh, most everywhere up the coast seeing some rain, and we'll show you when that's going to move in, but it's certainly uh, going to change. It's going to get a lot cooler over the weekend as well. By the way, it is Flannel Friday. That's why I'm wearing this, but here we go. Here's a look at Westport right now, and you can see a nice day even out on the coast right now. Some spots on the coast are seeing some rain. Uh, winds are out of the south southwest of 14 miles an hour in Seattle, so still a bit breezy. 50 degrees is where we are right now. We're off to a high today of about 54. Uh, you can see current temperatures 49 in Bremerton, 49 in Port Angeles. But take a look across the map here. It is cooler in every uh, spot across western Washington right now. 10 degrees cooler in Bellingham than it was yesterday at this time. And you can certainly feel that right when you go outside. Let's take a look at Seattle today. You can see the showers are going to return late in the afternoon, but only for a little bit. We're going to see rain in the afternoon commute, and then it starts to uh, clear out again. And then the showers come back tomorrow. In fact, tomorrow is going to be a pretty rainy and breezy day. As we talked about, daylight saving time ends on Sunday at 2 a.m. where we do our fall back and on Sunday the sunset as we mentioned 443 p.m. So it's going to get dark early. Your almanac yesterday 57 was where we got to in Seattle. 55 was our average high and the record back in 1949 when it was 74 degrees. Big football game this weekend in Seattle. The Huskies uh, are playing Oregon and you can see kickoff at 430. But take a look at that. It's going to be breezy. Winds out of the south 15 to 30 miles an hour. Gusts to 40 miles an hour. Uh, rain at times and uh, windy. I'll be there with the kids. I know Blaine, our producer, is wearing her Husky shirt today, so that's awesome. We take a look at our uh, radar going on right now over the last couple of hours. This was the band of showers that moved through and created some heavy rain a little bit earlier. We also have some lightning strikes out on the coast, as you can see, but our future cast is going to show you uh, when it's going to get uh, rainy again by this evening's commute. We should see some scattered showers, and then it does get a little wet again tomorrow as we move into Saturday with the rainy and breezy conditions. Here's your seven day forecast rain to showers today and high of 52 and then take a look at next week. Temperatures hovering in the upper 40s for the most part, but rain at times and windy Saturday. Sunday will be a little bit of a better day, but not much. Monday will definitely be better than the weekend with a high of 50 with partly sunny skies.